Hi guys, this is Abhi from Gokche Design. Once you have your image pulled up, the first thing I want you to do is to duplicate the layer. Next, I'm going to click on the Spot Healing Brush Tool and use the normal mode with Content Aware selected. I'm also going to select a brush size which is just a tiny bit bigger than the pimple. Now I'm going to paint over the pimples one at a time. Make sure you go very slowly. Feel free to make multiple passes and keep going until the skin feels relatively smooth. I'm also going to rename the layer to Spot Heal. Next, I'm going to make a copy of the Spot Heal layer and rename it to Smooth Skin. Let's also right click on this layer and convert to Smart Object. Next, go to Filter, click on Other, and then select High Pass. I'm going to leave in the default value of 24. I'm also going to apply the Gaussian Blur filter on the same layer. Let's select Blur and then Gaussian Blur. And we're going to leave in a value of around 8 for the radius. With the Smooth Skin layer selected, I want you to use the Command I or Control I shortcut to add inverse adjustment to this layer. Now I'm going to play around with the blending modes and select a blending mode which gives me the smoothest skin. The linear light blending mode seems the best to me, so I'm going to select that. Now it's time to apply a layer mask and fill the layer mask with black. Black means hide and white means show. Finally, we're going to use the brush tool to apply white color using a soft brush over the areas that have blotchy skin. In other words, we are selectively unmasking the areas where we want the skin to be smoother. And that should do it. Let's compare the before and after. And it looks good to me. Make sure you like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.